There is a clown inside your head. Let's find out what to do about him. Today, we'll talk to you about how you should handle the automatic negative self-talk that's going on inside your head. Stay with me all the way to the end of the video so you won't miss any of the important tools and tricks. This is Natural Health Evolution, and if you're looking for ways to eliminate stress and anxiety and boost your brain power, then this is the channel for you. So make sure you hit the subscribe button and press the little bell icon so that you'll get notified when we release new and informative videos. Did you know that humans on average have 70,000 thoughts per day? That's a lot of thoughts, and unfortunately, many of them are negative ones. Most of the time, we are not aware of what we are thinking. It happens automatically, and with the negative self-talk, we often create our own distorted reality. For example, you are always making a fool out of yourself. You can never do anything right. You never understand anything people are explaining. You must be so stupid. And so on. Nice, huh? Not really. The voice in our heads is a real asshole. Well, here is what you should do about it. Step one, become aware of what you are thinking. This sounds very simplistic, but we actually have to put some effort into doing it because as we said, the thoughts happen automatically. The next three days, I want you to start noticing what kind of negative things you are actually saying to yourself inside your head. Step two, put a name on the negative self-talk. Remember when you were in school, back when you were a little kid? Remember that annoying kid that always had to make fun of everyone and was a real pain in the butt? What was his name? Use that name and pretend it is a real person who is saying all those negative things to you instead of your own brain. Step three, and here's the trick. See that person in front of you, but shrink him down to one foot tall and put a clown nose on him. Also, Give him a real squeaky voice, like Mickey Mouse, for example. This may sound silly, but don't underestimate it, because the reason it works is precisely because of the fact that it is silly. After all, if a one-foot, silly-voiced, annoying person with a clown's nose started mocking us, would we take him seriously? <laughs> nope, we would not. We would simply brush it off as stupidity. And that is exactly what we're going to do with that clown inside our head from now on as well. Laugh at him. He's just a goofy clown that hasn't got a clue about who we are. We'll be back with more brain tools in the next video. Also, we have a 100% free ebook called Discover Anxiety Solutions that you should check out. To get it, just type into your URL address bar, naturalhealthevolution.com slash ebook. It is 100% free and we think you would like it. Thank you for watching and we'll see you in the next video.